we can't go down this nope. road, and no, guess no, what? No, no, no. I didn't say f up, I meant f and, uh, I feel like bad, and I apologize. You're just rolling okay. down a hill, you know? Yeah, sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry. All you have to do now is, we get is just call it and go to sleep, and everyone's good. Okay. Yeah? Right. We're gonna shut that down. Please do. Right where it is. Please do. We'll put the lid on alcohol now. Uh, actually, can okay. we do one more okay. round of champagne? We're, not, we're in trouble. We're all adults. Go to sleep. What we find? What we find? They're so intoxicated. Don't want to ruin the charter. I've warned them not to get back in the water. But if they want to make the bad choice, that's on them. I will go back to the marina and call the charter off. Sorry. No, we still. Like call it night. Yeah. Apologize. We could. It's fine. We're good. It's fine, Brandon. <laughs> oh my God. Here we go. I want my suitcase. Poor thing. <laughs> I'm spraying. But yeah. <laughs> what are you laughing at? It's just so cool that you're Australian. <laughs> I love the way you talk. <laughs> it's hysterical. Growing up in Brooklyn, we lived in an apartment underneath the train. I was like five years old, and I watched the movie called Kangaroo Jack, and it was about two guys from Brooklyn who went to Australia, and I've always wanted to go to Australia. Brother, I can't go back to Brooklyn without seeing a kangaroo. That's so funny. Hey, mate, like, get the f out of my face, you know what I mean? Like, this, there's no way this is real right now. I love that you, yeah, I love it. I like it. Oh, sweet. All right, stay positive. Oh, did I tell you that you know, the stewardess didn't make a flight? What? She can't be here for two days. Are you joking? Yeah, I'm joking. She'll be here this morning. OK. Game time, baby. Good morning, how are you? Um, last night, we had guests go in the water, which I had to get woken up for. After we'd all gone down? Yep. I didn't even know about that. I was up till 3 o'clock. I feel really bad. We've hit the ground running. We've been short of staff. We're trying to all work through. Do you want to leave someone up until maybe like two tonight? Yeah, like I said before, keep someone else up later. Okay. So we've got support for our stewardesses. Work all that out. Yeah, yeah. I'm so sorry. At the end of the day, it was my decision to go to bed. I've been bosun two and a half years. I should know better. I'm working on getting us another deckhand very quickly. I think we need it. Yeah, we do. Thanks, Kat. Right on. What are they having for breakfast? Lobster or crab bennies. The fruit platter will be in the middle. I'm going to do hollandaise sauce. I was about to make hash browns, but then I just realised there's no cheese grater in this galley. Oh, this is this one. I'll take that. That gin. Yeah, I'll do that then. So normally I feel like I'm actually quite highly organised, but this galley's difficult because there's nowhere to put anything. Am I putting that in the sink? No, Just trying to get an order flowing. For some reason, I'm just not handling this galley. It's handling me, which Captain Jason was, but... <laughs> morning. Did you know that Brendan went overboard at two this morning? None of us were. Yeah, up. so that... Okay, so like half the issue was we had no deck team up, and I think it might have been Lara, maybe like woke Cap. So Cap think I woke up at two thirty in the morning. Yeah, well, Cap oh. just called me to the bridge to talk about it. But that's a full ass man overboard. We need to get our together. Yeah. There's gonna be a change tonight. It's about shifts and what we need because we're down crew. Let's make it happen. Let's go. Oh. The light. Good morning. Good morning. The new shoe's gonna be here any minute. Ah, which is awesome. I wonder if Brandon's up. OK. I oh, tell you what, not yet. yet. We're not doing breakfast yet. And others, they were sitting. Yeah, I won't put it on the table yet, because it's not breakfast till 9. OK. I have experience of being chiefs too. I love it, because you're running the show. And thanks to my background in hospitality industry, my standards are very high up. There's a lot going on. <laughs> I don't do no shortcut. Can you stay down here? Sorry, yeah. I really need some more orange juice. Orange juice. I better get back up, because she yeah, asked for a while ago. Okay. Go, go, go. Shall I put the flag up? Yeah, we should. How's your bowline abilities? Oh, mate, top notch. Beautiful. I'm new to this size boat, but working with my brother, I do all the lines, all the everything by myself on a 60, 82 foot boat. Like, they're big boats that I'm driving by myself. I got the knowledge, I got the brains. Right way around is everything. Nailed it. Good morning. You guys hustled so much yesterday because we drank fast and you did a great job. Yeah. We're... Your friend stayed up and ended up being in the water, so we almost had a problem. Oh, my God. Good morning. Good morning. Hi, how are you? Would you like crab, lobster, or bacon eggs benedict? 
lobster. Make crab. Sure crab and lobster. Do mine the same way as hers. In the champagne. So when mine is empty, that means refill. Okay, sure. That sounds like a squeak. Is this? I'll tie this one. I, I need champagne in my room when I wake up in the morning. Yeah. Five fifteen is a good time. Okay, well, I'm, I won't be up at 5.15, but <laughs> I can get it to you as soon as I wake up.